What is happening guys? I'm your boy Coley Cole and today we're going to be playing Animal Crossing on the Switch and so far I've been having a blast with this game and this is going to be day 5 for me so we're going to check out some of my progression in the game seeing what's going to be built today as well so without further ado let's go check out Animal Crossing let's go alright so right now it is 10.36 on the 23rd so I'm actually doing this in real time. I feel like I don't want to time travel because I will shortchange myself and, you know, not experience the full game since this is my first time playing this series. All right. So let's check out what's the news for today from Tom Nook, Mr. Good Old Nook. So I named my island Eagle Isle and today we gain a few new residents. So it says here we gain Mo. We're going to check out who Mo is. So he's busy unpacking today. So we're going to check on him. And then for all you DIY Love It Island resident out there, I have a special announcement. Ooh, let's go check it out. Hmm. Then we will take part in a special customization workshop that he is hosting. Learning how to customize will help change the look of any DIY project you create. Hmm, looking forward to that. I have no doubt it will broaden your creative ex expertise. So we'll conduct this DIY workshop inside the resident services. All right, so that's really the news for today. So let's talk about what I did yesterday. So yesterday I completed, um, well, I built up three different houses for three new residents that's supposed to be coming at some point within the game. And uh, also I got a construction kit for the bridge, my first bridge for my island so we're gonna go ahead and see what that look like all right so here's my character super saiyan coley i decided to make an outfit you know for one of my favorite anime characters which is vegeta so i made a vegeta shirt and i turned my hair yellow all right so we're super saiyan cold today all right so we send a payment of your bank account for 30 oh 384 bells Thank you for your service. See you at the shop soon. All right, so we're gonna head over to the shop right now. I hit my little flowers. So, once you get to day four, um, the shop actually closed at eight in the morning, or they open at eight, excuse me, and close at 10 p.m. So, there's some things. Here's the drop box here. So. Um, no, I don't want to sell anything right now. Let's go inside. See what kind of new items we could get today. All right, so this is the second stage of Nook and Cranny. You know, the first one was like their little tent. Now we have uh, all kinds of items. I could buy a teddy bear, which I already got a big old bear in my house already. Um, this wooden, I don't even know what that is. Like a, a wooden cart. Um, let's see what's the hot item of, the, of today is. Yeah, I know, so. Uh, I guess there's not gonna tell me what's going on. All right. Let's see what's new in the cabinet. So, you know, we got normal stuff. We got a minted umbrella. Nothing too fancy. Got some wrapping paper, some normal stuff. And then really nothing new for wallpaper or flooring. So, kind of like my wallpaper in my house, actually. So, let's, thank you, thank you, no problem. All right, so right now, we're gonna check out this bridge. So this is the new bridge that was built, being built yesterday. So it's finally there, so I can easily walk across this river bank here. All right, and then uh, we got the houses. 
So this is the new house right here. I don't know if they're here. This is going to be Mo house. And I don't know if he's here yet. But let's go see. Let's go inside. Yeah, they go Mo. Oh, I'm packing this stuff. It's going to take me all day. So can you please come back tomorrow? We live on the same island now, so we'll be able to play every day. Cool. So we're going to let him unpack. You know, now, um, I got Mo. I took the Nook Miles ticket and went to another island. Hopefully, you guys are using your Nook Miles. And, uh, so I've been talking to some of these characters that was over there that, you know, I thought that was kind of cool. So I invited them to my island. So I would assume that the other two characters that I talked to, who I kind of forgot the name of, is going to be heading to my island as well. So, oh wait, I did that wrong. So we vent over here, so we got number two here, you know, which is north of Mo. And then the other is over here somewhere, hold on. I don't remember why I put number one. Oh yeah, okay. Never mind. I put number one on the other side of this thing. I want him to be near the beach. So he's down here somewhere. There we go. Oh, so that is Mo. Okay. I'm confused myself. Maybe I don't remember where I put the other house at. Yeah, Mo was near the beach. And then, oh, okay. Here we go. I'm over here confusing myself. All right, so this is the dirt house. All right, so I guess they're going to be coming at a later time. So I'm going to hook up this spot and whatnot and continue to move over. Oh, who's this guy? Harvey. We got a new character on the island. I thought so. I'm from, like, the next island over. My name is Harvey. Glad to meet you, my friend. You call me Harv. <laughs> okay, Harv. He said nobody never does. All right, so what you came here for, buddy? I thought I'd check it out for myself. So he's like, this place was deserted. Well, it's not deserted no more, my guy. Just a noodle and had a, a casserole of idea. Oh, God, you should visit my island. Just hit the airport and tell him, hey, I want to go to Harvey Island. That's the name of my pad, Groovy, right? Anyway, nice John. Jo oh, jarring with you. <laughs> I'm going to stroll around and see what makes Eagle Owl tick. All right. Hmm. So we definitely going to check that out. Go to Harvey's Island. So now what I'm going to do is I got a whole bunch of bells. Ooh, there's some mail. We're going to check that out in a minute. So I have a whole bunch of stuff in storage that I need to sell. And uh, it's a whole bunch of butterflies. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just go ahead and put some of these items in storage. And I have these emperor butterflies that I want to sell. So I'm definitely keeping that. We'll put the fence in storage. I haven't even opened this present yet. Let's open it up, see what we got. Oh, we got some money. <laughs> definitely putting that away. All right, hardwood. Cool. All right, so I should have enough space for these butterfly. Oh wait, in my in my um, inventory, yeah, I definitely did not mean to exit out the house. Oh, so here go all the emperor butterflies. Now, the only thing I don't like about this part is that you got to select each one by one. I feel like you should be able to, you know, select multiple items in your storage, to make it easier. Hopefully, they'll fix that with like an update, possibly. And actually, I got some other bugs in here that I could be selling. Got a centipede. You know? I don't know. We, we're going to sell some of this stuff. 
Oh. Uh, all right. Now, actually, I'm probably just going to sell the butterfly first so I can get the money. But I don't know if the owl has... I forgot his name. I don't know if the owl has some of these creatures. But we're going to go to Nook. I want to sell the stuff here. Nook Cranny. Seem like you're interested in the fortune teller set. No, I'm definitely not. I'm interested in trying to sell these items. I'm actually gonna pass that. Anything else? No, there's nothing else. Yes, yes, of course. What you need? I want to sell these butterflies. Now the reason why, now how I got all these butterflies, I actually used my ticket, my Nook Miles ticket, and I went to a uh, uh island a remote island and it was just so many different butterflies there it's freaking amazing i was like oh and i'm getting fifty two thousand bells for this <laughs> definitely sold gotta make this bank no problems we're on our way so we got some points so we're gonna go ahead and claim claim this all right so we got over ten thousand nook points right now and let's see what else I have. Okay, that's pretty much it. All right, next, let's go over to the museum. Now, maybe I might want to donate some stuff that he doesn't have. We'll see. I'm pretty, I'm not sure. Or maybe you could donate multiple things. I know you could donate multiple uh, butterflies. I would assume you could uh, donate multiple critters as well so let's wake his behind up bathers that's who i couldn't remember his name welcome to eagle eye museum yeah i want to donate some stuff for you let's see yeah we're gonna donate a honeybee some stink bugs yeah you can have all that nice play bit cool now I see you donated multiple with the same items due to we do uh though we need only one you may keep the extra oh okay well I'm fine there we go there we go so yeah he only need one so I'll keep all the extra ones and then I could just sell the rest at Nook and Cranny so I could actually sell the centipede and the stink bud there so let's go ahead and go back in here, make some money. Like I said, I'm all about making that dough. And, and plus, I want to expand my house, make it bigger. So let's go. What do we need today? I want to sell the rest of these bugs I have. All right, so we got the sting bug and the centipede. Uh, I can buy these from for a total of 420 bells. That's it. Uh, I guess I'm going to sell this. Let's go. All right. All righty. So let's just go check our inventory again. Oh, wait. I got some more bells. Oh, I didn't. Okay. Put it away. My wallet's too full. Oh, I, bro, I did not know you could only put. Wow. You can only put. You can only keep 99,000 bells. <laughs> that surprised the heck out of me. Oh, that's interesting. Did not know that. So I guess we got to really put money in the bank. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I forgot about this custom DIY workshop. So we'll worry about that in a minute. But let's go ahead and put this money. So I got 200 bonus miles. So 
I'm going to deposit like 50 G's in here for now. All right. I feel like we don't need that much. Actually, that's the, and also we want to pay off some more debt. Hold on. Cause you know, I want to pay, I want to pay some of this back. So pay from pocket, we'll pay 20,000. All right, next we're going to check out this uh, workshop. Let's go talk to Tom Nook here. Uh, all about that workshop. Let's go. Ready to dip your toes into the delightful uh, waters of customization code? Yeah, let's go. That's the spirit. Let's get started. I believe a brief explanation about customization is in order. First, you need the item you want to customize, along with the required number of customization kits. Then you can customize your item at the workbench, okay? The design or, cool or color will change in the blink of an eye. Do you believe you'll find it easier to understand once you try yourself? Yeah. Uh, your goal for the session is to make a wooden wardrobe and then do some customization. The wardrobe you make as well as the uh, closet and chest and other items, store clothing are quite useful. All right. You can use them easily to change it to clothes you have stored in your home. Storage. Okay. Let's do this. Tom, look, I got a lot to say. Uh, I gotta get the recipe. Thank you. Thank you very kindly. All set. Alright, so let's check out this. Uh, so let's take this workshop. Oh, okay. I gotta get what I need. So we'll worry about that later. All right. All right, Super Super Saiyan Cole is out. Out and about. Let's see, what do I have? I could put this money back, you know, in my wallet, so to speak. So, got a few items. So we're gonna go to Harvey Island. I do want to check that out. So um, we're gonna instantly fly there. So let's go. All right. So we've touched down in Harvey's Island. So we're gonna check it out. Let's go. Oh, he got like he got all kinds of birds. Can, I wanna. Can you actually capture a bird? He got all kinds of birds. Uh, Harvey, how you get to your island that fast, bro? The magic of video games. Hey there, Cole. Good to see you again. Good to see you too. I was on the same flight as you over here, so it's good to see you soon again. Ah, uh, I like how they did that. That was the day that we talked, right? I didn't just sleep the whole time. So. Nah, bruh. You're not going crazy. Don't mention it. Let's run a photo shoot here. It's called... Oh. Oh. Photopedia. Hmm. All right. Let's see. Let's go inside. Let's see what this house is all about. All right. So right now we are in Harvey's house, and right now he's 
explaining how this photopia thing work or whatever so let's see let's talk about these sets there are six different rooms here you can set each of them up however you like you can press the down d-pad to change the decor in the studio just like you do at home oh speaking of set decorations i got a special deal with nook shopping so if you so if it's in your catalog you can just borrow one on the spot to use in your set oh that's nice I guess if you go and done Nook's Ink customization workshop, you could borrow stuff in other colors too. Alright. That's everything I know about sets. Let's see. What about uh, models? <coughs> There's nothing wrong with being your own model. If you're feeling selfish, <laughs> but... You can also invite the models. Oh, in fact, you can invite up to 10 models if you want to take a group photo. Now, these aren't professional models, mind you, more like neighbors that live on your island. But if you got an Animal Crossing character amiibo, you can use those to invite other folks. Oh, so that's what the amiibo comes into play. Okay, I'm gonna have to buy me an amiibo. It might not actually be able to come though. None of them ever show up when I invite them. Anyways, you could call others by pressing down and tapping the amiibo to the NFC touch point. All right. Oh, and one more thing. You can ask a model in your studio to strike a certain pose if you like. Okay. Oh, you do... Um, ZR to do the polls. Alright, cool. What else? What about wardrobe? You wear... You want to wear... You want your models to wear cost, costumes that match your set, right? For the wardrobe to come into play. So, Nook Shopping lends me the clothes. Just like it does furniture. So, you can borrow anything in your catalog. Even better, your models can wear your costumes too. A wardrobe change are a snap. Just know that since everybody likes different stuff, a resident won't wear certain things. Really? Oh my gosh. So again, we press down. Just select a character. Press X. If they're outfit. Ew. And last thing is taking a picture. Oh, just the basic function on the controller. Oh, uh, says you can't use your Nook phone when you're changing studio settings. Um, all that means is that you have to finish up your settings before you use the camera, though. Oh, okay. I mean, that makes sense. Hey, now like this everything. Oh, I'm all good, buddy. Oh, so I'm gonna freshen up my ear. <laughs> Come grab me outside if you need anything. Alright. Bet. Let's be nosy. Oh, just got some nook mouse down here points Ooh, got 300 there Let's go inside pop in I'm gonna go deeper into his house I'm gonna hit down so when you see a a display hole and a meeple near the NFC touch point to call that character. But obviously, I don't have nothing. I actually pressed the wrong button. Alright, so. Pretty much my stuff. 
I have. I got so dead in there. Oh, that's dope. <laughs> that's crazy. So this is stuff I'm borrowing. Okay. I don't know. No, I don't want to lose this. Why? Okay, there we go. Okay. So basically, you just throw in here, decorate in here. This way, you like take your picture. Pretty cool. All right. I wonder if I could like harvest some stuff here. I'm on his island. Okay, let's give it a shot. Alrighty. Oh uh, no, I'm secluded in this little spot here. Yeah, I can't use none of my tools here. So, yep. The only thing you could do is go inside and you know take pictures with the characters and stuff like that. So, so there's nothing else here for us to do. So we're just gonna go back. I'm ready to fly out, partner. Ready to go home. All right. Now so back to Peace Town. Yep. Uh. That's funny. He call it Peace Town. I guess there's nothing but peaches in my island. Right. Go ahead. All right. So. Uh, before we end this uh, video, we're going to craft this wardrobe that we need. So hopefully I got enough material. Yes, I do. So it takes 12. So let's go ahead and craft it. Let's do this. Then we're going to take it back to Tom Nook. All right, I'm done for now. So let's head back over there. Oh, got some. Um, got a friend. See, somebody's online. Or no, so why is it going off? Okay, that's weird. So let's go back to his tent. All right, Mister Nug, I got this uh, wardrobe you been telling me about. Alright, so. Yeah. I think that means it's time for you to customize it. I'll give you the customization, customization kit you need in a moment. For now, please step to the workbench. Alright. Head over here. Look like you're ready now with the wooden wardrobe. I think that means it's time for you to customize it. Okay. Thank you very much. Oh, so, oh, this is, bro, so I could change different colors. Well, since blue is my favorite color, I'm definitely painting the blue. Now. But to do it, you need two of those kits, though. I got 50 of them. Wow, that's dope. So let's customize this. Yes. Definitely gonna blow out my uh, house when I get a chance. All right. Yes, yes, masterfully done. As you just seen, customizing item is quite easy when you have a customizer kit in the workbench. You can take extras from today as my gift to you. Thank you. As a gratitude of my workshop, you now be able to buy any kits you need from my shop. Now, for the most part, you can customize furniture and other items you made as DIY projects. However, some of the mass market furniture items sold at the shop can also withstand some customization. For example, you might be able to change up an item, fabric, or, or add a custom design to it. Oh, okay. Figure out what you could customize and how you could customize it 
can be a lot of fun. And this concludes our workshop on customization. I hope you enjoyed putting on a fashion show in your home using your custom wedding wardrobe. Thank, thank you, thank you. Now, take a break. I do believe you earned it. All right, thank you very much. So we're gonna go back into the house, drop this wooden wardrobe off. Hey, my, I just noticed my flowers is growing quite nicely a little bit. Definitely gotta water them today too. All right, so, hmm. I don't know where I'm gonna put this at. Oh, I kind of don't want to put it near the window. So, actually, I'm gonna take this fish. Oh, I took the radio too. <laughs> so, let's move my Eiffel. Let's move some of this stuff over here. So, I'm gonna put my Eiffel Tower. I kind of like that thing. Or, I said Eiffel Tower. Tower of Pisa. Let's, let's move it over just a little bit. There we go. I'm mean, gonna be sitting right there. I'm gonna put this bad boy over here. There we go. And then, uh, let's see what else I got. That's really it. So, we're gonna. Oh, my radio. Hmm. I don't know where I wanna put my radio at. Uh, we probably just put it like right in front of my bed or over the side. I kind of like that radio. Go ahead and drop it there. Boom. There you go. Listen to some music. Then the tower, the, the tire is, uh, we'll probably throw that outside somewhere for now. So. Go back outside. And of course, with everything that we do, we got more Nook Mouse. Scroll down here. Okay. Did I like miss it or something? I don't know. It was going off. I just don't see anything. Okay, that's kind of weird. Maybe it just added like something. Then my best friend list keep going on too. I don't know. I'm gonna keep scrolling over. Okay. I got something else over here. All right, guys. So that was day five on Animal Crossing. So so far we are able to design our furniture now. Uh, we met Harvey, so we could take photos with some amiibos or characters from our island and do some cool um, photo ops. And what else we did? We got a new bridge. Uh, there's a new resident he's unpacking in his house right now. And there's going to be two more residents coming in the future in the next couple of days. All right. So, but like I said earlier, we're going to try to do more videos of this offline. We're still going to be doing some streaming probably tomorrow of day six. But appreciate you guys watching this video. And let me know what you think. What should I do next on the comment below? All right. So I'm Coley Cold. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys soon. I'm out.